Hello, I'm Liz with Rare Books Digest, and today we are going to be talking about Luigi Serafini's enigmatic book, Pulcinellopedia Piccola. As is common with Serafini's works, Pulcinellopedia Piccola is filled with baffling and unseemly illustrations which require much thorough examination and inference to decipher what exactly the artist is intending to portray. Within the pages of the book, the reader is introduced to the impish and conniving puppet Pulcinella, or as he is also known, Mr. Punch. Pulcinella habitually dresses in a contrast of black and white, which illustrate the stark division between life and death. He is commonly clothed in white, and his surly face is hidden behind a bold black mask. There is one defining feature of Pulcinella's face which cannot be hidden behind his mask, however. This feature is Pulcinella's very large and pointed nose, which illustrates his strangely acutely sensual nature. Pulcinella is also distinguished by the pasta and wooden spoon which he carries. These objects intrigue the reader further, as Pulcinella is not a chef. Pulcinella's personality within the tale is shrouded in much mystery and bewilderment. He tends to behave under the guise that he is impertinent and not mentally cohesive to the happenings around him, but deep down he possesses a violent and merciless character which causes him to approach and attack many unsuspecting subjects. As odd and surreal as the figure Pulcinella and the book Pulcinellopedia Piccola may appear, they are widely recognized and loved around the globe. This, of course, allows for Pulcinella to be known under many varying names. In Germany, Pulcinella is known as Casper, while in the Netherlands, he is Jan Klassen. Denmark has deemed him as Mr. Jackal, while in Romania, he is known as Vassalosh. Hungary has dubbed Pulcinella as Vitez Laszlo, and in France, he is Pulcinelle. The United Kingdom has simply called him Mr. Punch, which is where the origination of the puppet shows Punch and Judy stem. Additionally, the renowned Russian composer Igor Stravinsky was inspired by Pulcinella to create two ballets in his honor, which he called Pulcinella and Petrushka. As is the case with Serafini's Codex Serafinianus, Pulcinellopedia Piccola is extremely scarce with a limited edition of 5,000 copies. The text is in Italian and it is filled with over 60 extraordinary pencil illustrations, some depicted in comic strip style. This particular copy of Pulcinellopedia Piccola is immensely valuable and sought after as it is one of the very few of Serafini's inscribed works as Serafini tended to avoid personal dedications as much as possible. Here we have an inscription as well as an illustration which Serafini created for his friend and comrade, the Uruguayan political architect and minister of public works, Walter Pintos Riso. Serafini drew a skyline to go along with his dedication, deeming the work one of a kind, rare, and valuable to Luigi Serafini collectors. To learn more about this and other rare and interesting books, please visit our website at www.rarebooksdigest.com. Thank you.